Hey hello programmers today we are going to build this kind of uh, animation by using react first mark you react first mark you is a one npm package it's, it's a very simple but very useful npm package so if you want to build this kind of animation you can use this uh, packages it's very uh, simple and useful i like uh, this if i want to build this kind of animations uh, so yeah let's get started so for uh, for making this kind of animation you have to uh, create react template so you can you can achieve uh, by uh, writing this command like npx create react type so i already created uh, this template so i keep this part you you guys please uh, create a template by using this command and please create react app app and then you 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 have to give you one uh, uh, the project name like uh, you can you can give react first marquee or whatever you want so uh, this is the comment you can uh, you can create react template by using this comment next you have to uh, you you have to install one uh, npm package which i told you uh, which is the react first marquee so you can uh, install react first Mercury. okay so after completing this we are ready to start coding and uh, the one beautiful thing you can you can customize you can customize uh, uh, this uh, animation based on your requirement uh, the react first mark you uh, if if you go react first mark you and vm packages below you can see some of the property and um, based on your requirement you can customize this project uh, as as you want okay so now we are ready to start coding so for uh, first i want to start coding from uh, app.js file because app.js file is a root file in react project uh, okay so before before i start coding i want to tell you one thing i uh, already downloaded some of the images uh, all are the logos uh, for to to make this um, animation so if you want to get these uh, images you can you can visit my uh, repo link i will i will give my repo link below the videos okay so uh, now i go to app.js file okay so now we can we are ready to start coding so uh, just i put a div tag uh, inside the div tag i just write a h1 tag and just uh, just give uh, give one title here the our technology partner the blah 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 okay for first we we have to we, we have to import a mark you from react first mark you react first mercury okay so i'm creating one div uh, to to write this mercury component okay so inside the mercury tag we have to pass component component might be a text images or the other things for simplicity i create a one div inside the div i uh, put the images and the uh, i i have to bring all images from the images uh, folder so uh, i have to bring all images so i already been 10 images uh, in app.js file so now we are ready to start using so if i save then we can see in our uh, browsers like okay so that is the our one component now it look like this so if we uh, copy and paste 10 times because we, we we have 10 images so now we can copy and paste 10 times so i already imported 10 uh, 10 uh, component uh, inside the mark you tab so now we can see okay so all images are here and it will look like this after importing 10 components here now it's time to customize the mark you, uh, animation so if you go to the mark uh, react first mark you, you can see uh, you can see some of the property below the uh, react first mark you page so style and class name is a very basic thing i don't want to explain this thing i want to start from the play so but uh, at the moment it it looks very uh, very ugly in our um, uh, in our local host so now i want to add some css class uh, inside the deep, uh, in the in the deep uh, deep tech so by the way i already wrote some of the css in app.js app.css file if you want to get this uh, you can visit my repo link i will uh, give this in a description box so uh, after after give the class name the image will look like this okay now i want to customize this uh, animation for first one is the play so at the moment like default the play value is a uh, true 
huh? if you want to add the play uh, let's see what will be happen so if we pass the play so default if if i don't want to give any kind of value so default it will be true so let's see that is our the deploy version uh, this one is our the current version if we uh, reload it will look like uh, nothing changes so uh, nothing special if we uh, like uh, pass the value is, uh, is a false then what will be happen if we uh, reload then it's like uh, the animation is stopped if we hover over the component the animation will start if we pass the play value in the mercury tab okay so next one is a pause on hover so if i want to uh, hover over the component that time the component will stop uh, anim animating that time we can pass the pause on hover uh, property uh, inside the mercury so now uh, i pass pause on hover let's see what will be happen if we reload the the uh, animation is uh, uh, running if we hover over the component the component will st stop uh, any animating so if you want to uh, develop this feature you can just simply pass the uh, pass uh, pause on hover property in the uh, uh, in the mercury component okay another one is the direction at the moment direction is uh, right to left right so if you want to you know reverse the um, reverse the uh, di di direction so you can pass the direction property and simply pass like uh, at default is left so if you wrote right then what will be happen see now the animation is uh, left to right the before default it was a uh, 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 right to left now if you if you reverse the direction you can pass the direction property as a, a right so you, you can achieve this thing okay so another one is speed so default speed is a 20 so if you want like more speedy then you have to pass the uh, speed property speed and now i want to like the 50 then see what will be happen okay see it uh, now now it's more faster uh, before then now if i want the 100 then what will be happen okay it's it's more faster uh, before okay then uh, we can we can set the delay if we pass the delay property delay and i want to uh, start this thing after five second let's see what will be happen reload uh, nothing uh, happened because we we have to wait uh, wait uh, until the five seconds see uh, after completing the five second the animation is start okay then another one is uh, loop so loop is very simple the default number is zero 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 mean like a, it a, it will be like infinity is is infinity zero is equivalent to infinity so if you want to set the loop you can do like it's a number nothing special and another one is a gradient see uh, when the um, the component come from left to right gradient is visible here if if you don't want to like this gradient you can simply pass gradient to false uh, false then uh, then the gradient won't show so yeah that's it you can customize this thing uh, based on your requirement this if this video help you please uh, do like comment and share thank you and subscribe my channel